So whether you think, oh, what can I do with my hand? Or whether you think, oh, uh, how can I resist here? It's the same thing. That's why this is better than uh, making a fist and using strength. This is stronger than strength. But what's more important, it's not just strong, it's free. This is not free. This is not Shizentai, it's not natural. This is natural and free. So it doesn't mean that whatever happens, you can't bend your arm. Uh, in, a, in a physical way, it has to bend sometimes. But there's a big gap between making a fist and keeping your fingers open. So, uh, it doesn't matter whether your arm bends a little bit, I just wanted you to feel key. And when you do katatadori, try to put out water from your hand in the same way. You can't move, so just sit down. So water is coming out of my fingertips. He falls. So maybe he'll crumble a little bit when I do it like this, but it's really hard for me too. And it's not only really difficult for me, it's also not beautiful. And in my opinion, Aikido has to be beautiful. The movement and your mind should be beautiful. <laughs> if you have a beard in your face, that, that doesn't really matter. Your mind has to be beautiful. So I'm going to put this image in my mind to emit key. But if you take all that trouble to make that image, if you open your elbow, all the trouble is for nothing. Because it's not natural. This is natural. I can't do anything. I can do things at my pace. If I do this, then it's my partner's pace. So close your elbows. So imagine there's, you're holding an egg here. So uh, if you put it too close, it breaks, and if you open it too far, it falls. So just uh, lightly keep it there. So let's practice putting out key, making key flow from our fingers from kata dodori. And there's an egg under your arm. And with this image, turn around and he'll fall. <laughs>